How much time do you spend thinking about possible failure, potential failure, something that hasn't even happened yet? And the failure thoughts might come to you in the form of no one will ever want to read this. No one will ever want to buy this. No one will understand what I'm doing. No one will want to hire me to help them. Uh, no one will value what I'm offering enough to pay what I want them to pay. No one will need what I'm creating. And I just want to offer, again, I'm repeating myself today because I think this bears repeating, that for every failure thought you have, there's an alternate success truth. So yes, not everyone will want to read what you're going to write. And yes, not everyone wants to buy your art or hire you as their coach, but this is a planet filled with 7 billion people and you don't need all 7 billion of them to want to read your book or your blog uh, or listen to your podcast or buy your jewelry or have them, you create a website for them, right? You only need probably at first a dozen or, or so just to get started. And, and if you can believe in your heart in your mind even, logically, that yeah, it's possible there are a dozen people on the planet who need what I'm selling. It gets a whole lot uh, easier to show up every day and think, yeah, I, I, I believe this. There's somebody out there that needs what I want. And this is basically, you know, what I help my clients do day after day is I teach them to consistently bring their focus back to what's possible and to the doable because our brain wants to go to the impossible and all the reasons why something is not gonna work. Um, it's, it's a learned skill, but even when we learn the skill ourselves, there's something to having somebody else there with you that has that perspective, who's not in the mind drama that you are in and is not dealing with the exact thing you are. So I have perspective to be able to see that and help you replace the thoughts that are not serving you. Like no one will ever want to buy this with Oh yeah, there, there's probably one person at least on the planet that this is right for. And then once you can believe that there's, there's one person, it's just the adding zeros tactic that I do. I add, if there's one, there's 10. If there's 10, there's 100. And we don't even have to go any further than that. But it's true that if there's 100, there's 1,000. <laughs> so that's the way I think about my business. That's the way I help the people that I work with think about not only their, their professional creative endeavors, but their personal ones as well. There are people out there for you. Your people are out there, but they won't know about you if you're not showing up. So that is what I'm here for. I'm, help, I'm here to help you show up and get your creative ideas and dreams out of your brain and your mind and your thought loops and into the world. If you're ready for that, please book a clarity call. Let's get on the phone and talk about how we can work together and how, how I can help you do that. All right. Have a great Magic Action Monday and I'll see you next time.